<laughs> so here's what we're going to do. Do you know if you analyze the pictures before, how many people use the, um, the construction paper viewers that I gave you? Oh, yeah. Remember they were little squares? Mm -hmm. And what did you do with those? Like, um, <coughs> we use them to take out part of it and just pay attention to one part. Yes. And then mm -hmm. move it around. So we're going to do that with the smartboard on one very famous image. And I didn't even give you the title of it. I want you to, on your sticky notes, I want you to write down some thoughts. And then you're going to come and pop them on here. I just put engraving. It was an engraving by Paul Revere. But I'm not giving you the title because it gives it away. Engraving is sort of like um, a way that they reproduce pictures. We can talk about that. It's a form of artwork. Okay. So we're going to look at one by Paul Revere all together. And then you're going to do some in groups on your own. You do the same thing in small groups. And I have... All sorts of good stuff for you. So what I'm going to do is the picture's behind here. I'm going to show you part of the picture. And then I want you to write down your thoughts. Okay. What do you see? Uh, where's my little things? When you get in your groups, you're going to have like, little cards that you can talk as a group. So some of the cards are like, is there anything missing? Why was this image created? What can I learn from this? What do you notice first? Um, I'm not even going to give you these now. You'll get them some good questions for you to think about. So let's look at this part first. You ready? Okay. Oh, oh, no. Stop it right on the sticky note. Okay. So this is all I want you to look at. And I want you to look at everything you see in this picture. If I have, you might know what this picture is, right? Because it is very famous. And you studied Paul Revere last year. So just write down what you notice. Like you could start out with, I notice hmm, something. You could look at the setting, um, the people, what they're wearing, what their faces are doing. Yesterday I looked this up on, on a website and I found probably 15 things in this picture that I didn't notice. <laughs> Unless I looked at it really closely like this and kind of took it apart. Oh, interesting. <coughs> when you're ready and you have some thoughts about this picture, come pop them up here. You want to look at these all together. intentional, you have a purpose for everything, same with this. Everything that's in here, every little line and color and detail has a purpose. It's intended for you to notice. Okay. Yeah. 
All right, you know what? Let's look at the whole picture. Dun, da, da, da. I know it. I knew it. You already knew this because you're so smart. So now we could do this again and put sticky notes on another part of the chart where we notice. What do we notice now about the whole thing? We didn't even need to see this middle part before. Everybody knows what it is, right? What is it called? Faster. You can. Yeah. Okay, so I think it's probably better if you get in your table group. And then if we need to move people around, you will. There's only so, like three people. Uh, each, then we'll move people. If yeah, three people is good, then you have more time to talk, more chance to talk. So each each group is going to get this packet. This picture is in there, so you can skip it. We already talked about that one. Now you have all of these. Um, some of them are engravings, some of them are drawings, some of them you've seen in your social studies journal already. And I've labeled them A, B, C, D, E, F, G, so when we talk about them, we can maybe say well, this, this picture, picture B, okay, because I try not to give you captions or anything like this. Well, and then in your group, I would like it if you did this, all of you stay on the same image. Don't share, don't sort them out yet. All of you kind of get around it and look at it together, and then take some of these cards and ask these questions. Pick some of these cards and ask the questions about the pictures, <coughs> images. Can we pick our own groups? Well, why don't you go to your table groups and then we'll move people around. So go back to your table groups, take all your things. Also, everyone pay close attention to this guy climbing up a wall. <laughs> Wait, there's weapons. I can't see them. Well, why is he right here, Sarah? So? Wait, what, do? what do these words say? It says, like, day. Okay. A long, long, God, the gift of the hand is that the con is reduced. Okay. Uh, what do you notice first? I know it's the horse's blood. So do I. Yeah. But do you notice the tail? What is that? Is someone riding the horse? And you can it's, tell? it's the little saddle. Is this image like anything else you see or read about in this in history? And like this one shows about all the countries. Separating so, and that and that snake one kind of like this one because the, like all the plants are all separated and they went like that because they all separated the part two of the Yeah, the axe is right there, and then there's a few more swords right there. I just thought that that kind of was awkward. Yeah, he was just like holding a stick with a weapon stuck in it. Yeah, I think it means like that guy's That guy, this guy with the flags trying to grab the rope, he's doing. And then in the background, the sky grabs. Yeah, and he's riding backwards, and we know it can't be Paul Revere. Because Paul Revere would never ride backwards. 